Sometimes identifying the differences between space objects can be difficult. Today I'm going to talk about comets and asteroids. Comets are defined as relatively small icy objects that orbit stars. Asteroids are defined as relatively small rocky objects that orbit stars. Note, both are relatively small, both orbit a star, and both are categorized as small solar system bodies. Now the good part, the differences. What makes comets comets and what makes asteroids asteroids? Comets are made of ice and dust and little pieces of rock. Asteroids are made of rock and metals. This all has to do with their location. Comets are icy because they formed beyond the frost line. Asteroids are rocky because they formed in the inner solar system where metal and rock condensed. Comets can be found in both the Oort cloud and the Kuiper belt. This is the Kuiper belt, which can be found beyond the orbit of Neptune. And the Oort cloud, which is even bigger and really far from our sun is located at the edge of the solar system so it's more like way out like this. Asteroids come from a place a lot closer to us in the asteroid belt here between Mars and Jupiter. One of the main distinctions that you can use to tell the difference between asteroids and comets, which I think a lot of people already know, is that comets have tails and asteroids don't. The tails grow due to the warmth of the sun as the comet approaches, as the comet moves closer into the solar system from outside of the solar system in from either the Oort cloud or the Kuiper belt. As the comet moves closer in towards the sun, the ice starts to melt and it forms a tail. And asteroids, which are located inside of the inner solar system and relatively close to the sun, do not and we are not made of ice, do not melt. One of the final and important distinctions between comets and asteroids are their orbits. Comets have highly elliptical orbits. If you don't know what this means, take a look at this picture. Highly elliptical. Asteroids also have elliptical orbits. They're more elliptical than Earth's orbit and less elliptical than the orbit of comets. Okay, that is a short and simple explanation of how comets differ from asteroids and I hope you guys learned something and I hope you guys were able to understand what I was explaining and if you were interested in learning more about comets or asteroids or both then I left some links down down there so definitely go check those out if you're interested.